The Titanic, the name echoes with tragedy, a tale as old as time. So imagine it's 1912, the age of grand dreams and giant machines. And there's this ship, the Titanic. It's like the superstar of the seas, the biggest, the fanciest, the unsinkable legend built to impress and to conquer the Atlantic Ocean. Everyone thought this ship was invincible, a floating palace with swimming pools, grand staircases, and even a squash court. Yes, people played squash on a ship back then. Now the Titanic set sail from Southampton, England, heading to New York City with over 2,000 passengers on board, rich, poor, families, immigrants, all hoping for a better life. Now here's where things get interesting. Despite all the hype, the ship only had enough lifeboats for about half the people on board because back then safety regulations were not exactly up to today's standards. On the night of April 14th, the Titanic was cruising through icy waters at full speed because the captain wanted to make a record-breaking trip. Suddenly, out of nowhere, iceberg alert, but the crew didn't slow down enough. The ship hit the iceberg, ripping a huge hole in the side, and water started flooding in. What happened next is a mix of chaos, courage, and tragedy. Some people got lucky. Others faced unimaginable fear. Women and children were prioritized for lifeboats, but many men stayed behind. Some helped others, panicked, and the ship sank in about two and a half hours. The Titanic disaster shocked the world and led to huge changes in maritime safety, like more lifeboats, better radios, and international ice patrols. It's a story about human ambition and nature's power, a reminder that even the mightiest can fall. And that's why Titanic is still one of the most famous shipwrecks in history, a tragic epic story of dreams, hope, and loss. Do you know any obscure history facts? Share them below. We might feature your comment in an upcoming episode. And be sure to subscribe for more historical tales. Thanks for watching. See you next time.